Hey guys, it's BNO, and in the last part we we beat Baron Dante. In this part, we're going to be starting the special stages. Now, in order to unlock each of these stages, you have to beat the three stages before and get all six gobos in each of them. Uh, now, these stages are a bit just like ec extracurricular. It's just going to kind of expand on whatever the, the stages before would have done. So, you'll see similar elements to what we've seen before, and that's kind of what I was trying to do. Just kind of spread it out a little bit. Because you, you would have had to... Ugh, yes, X lag. Um, you will have had to beat all the main stages in order to beat the game, and that's why I was kind of spreading that out. But I wanted to try and get all the gobos in the process, just to show it off, just so I didn't have to replay the stages, which kind of happened a few times anyway. Um, now you may be wondering, why am I going over here instead of not in there? Well, that's just because, um, I am weird. No, that's because, uh, I go over here. Cuba. I don't like Cuba. <laughs> um, but you may be wondering, oh, so do you collect gobos still, or do you... Well, no, actually, you don't even collect golden crystals or anything. All you need in order to beat these stages completely is to just get the, um, puzzle piece at the end of the stage. For the most part, you don't really need to backtrack at all. Backtracking only will get you, like, extra lives and stuff. I probably might need those, because I'm gonna be sight playing, uh most of these stages. It's going to be... It's a little bit like uh, the secret stages in Warrior Land, but I'm, I'm not going to quit. Mainly because the worst was probably World 3. World 3 was probably the worst of the game. Um, that being said though, they will pull some tricky stuff off in the special stages. Um, but... Until then, you know. Where are all my lives go? Did I seriously? I I lost them all before, didn't I? Yeah. Not not because of turning off the game, no. Just because of I was really careless in four six. <laughs> seriously, that that last uh, secret, that last ending bit, that was just pretty brutal. Um, yeah. Remember these guys? I miss them so much. Seriously. Oh yeah, that was like one of them where you could jump in the pit. <laughs> it was the first one you saw and you could jump in the pit, it's just so weird. Oh okay, guys, so you may be wondering where are you going now? Well first of all, I believe the puzzle piece is actually at the top of that. Now that being said though, you can get a, I believe a key somewhere. I think you can get a key this way. It seems like it, yeah. I definitely know the puzzle piece was at the top of there. And you gotta go over here in order to get a key in order to get probably a few extra lives or so. So many... Oh, by the way, if you're gonna wanna grind for crystals and if you wanna get extra lives that way, um, do it in these special stages, because for the most part... For the most part, they're, they're pretty easy. There's some pretty tricky stuff in here. I'm okay with these thin platforms. Just not those extremely narrow ones. You know what I mean, well, three. You know exactly what I mean. And the sad part is that we still got three, well, three inspired stages to go. We had to deal with six of them and there's three more to go. Oh, gosh. The sequel has the strangest World 4. I'm, I'm really... I have this weird thing with World 4 and Croc 2. I, 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 I have, I definitely know I'm going to be playing it. Come on. Um, but, now don't pick up the puzzle piece. The puzzle piece is not like a golden crystal or a gobo. It will end the stage when you pick it up. So you want to make sure that if you're going to want to grab crystals and stuff, and really make sure you don't fall, make sure you go in here. Now, now this stage, I, this is the only special stage I remember actually doing as a kid, because I definitely, I definitely knew that there were special stages as a kid. Where the heck are the platforms gone? Where'd they go? Oh, there you go. But yeah, I, ha I haven't played any of the other ones other than this first one. So I'm going to be kind of blind from after this stage, which is a bit scary, because I'd prefer not being blind, therefore, but I have been kind of going rather blind, because I have I really haven't remembered any of these stages except for 4 5. 4 5 is my favorite stage, hands down. 
If you disagree, I shall show you the door. My goodness, this is tall. Do they just go, oh, look how tall we can make a room. <laughs> uh, there's two lives. I'm, I'm grateful for, the, for that. The music, man. The music. So yeah, if you're on like the PC or the Saturn version, you won't get some of the awesome versions of the songs. Um, if you wanna if you wanna get them, there's probably a PSX. There's probably a soundtrack rip. I'm saying probably because someone may be using it themselves. So we got a lot of lives for that, and that was it. So anyway, now we'll get lured on to the next stage, the Twisty Tunnels. It was the Curvy Caverns, and now it's the Twisty Tunnels. Um, so yeah, I... I... Don't know why... They, they're similar in name. Now you may be going 81, holy, cr holy crap. 1%. Yeah, these stages don't really go towards much. Mainly because it's just the puzzle piece, and then that's it. That being said, though... They look exactly the same from the first point, except one has a cuba at the beginning. I know they'll have they have a name. Or they look like cubas, just like Cookie Monster in four six. I know it's not Cookie Monster, but who cares? Okay, so if you want extra lives, just make sure you don't lose your crystals. And holy crap, I'm pulling them crystals for once. <laughs> oh! Stretchy platform. Stretchy platform is funny. It's like, wow. The sound makes it good. All right. So, off. Oh. All right. So yeah, I'm kind of pulling an all-nighter with this. I started recording at like 7:40, like from 3:3 onward, which is kind of weird. No, three, um, three, three, four, sorry. But I was going through the special stages. Oh, sorry, the, uh, additional stuff. So, yeah, if you got the key, you get the extra stuff. Other than that, yeah, these stages aren't terribly difficult. I might knock off three of them in one video, and then I might be able to do this in three parts. Three in one video, three in the next, two in the next, and I'll be able to knock off the first stage, and then two stages in the boss, and that's it. That'll be end game. Oh, for goodness sake. That'll be end game. Oh, I, re I remember this. It's just kind of awkward at, for the first one, just because... That. Go! Oh, for goodness sake. Okay. Three, two, one, go! Oh, goodness. I know there's like two lives up here or something, but, you know, it'd be nice to get them. If, you know, you grabbed onto the platform. That'd be nice. Ah, there you go. Other than that, then, it's pretty cool, just, you know, the fact that kind of move along with the platforms and they're all like right up here. That's pretty cool. I think there's two lives. Yeah, two lives. Oh, look how tall we can make the room! <laughs> Again, yeah. Ah, good old Argonaut. I think we're wondering how the heck do you get down? Just try jumping in the center. I'll keep you safe. Or you can take a death. Taking a death is fun. At times. But anyway, puzzle piece, which is a sprite. Technically, everything is sprite. The gobos are sprites? No, they're not. The, um, the crystals are sprites. And stuff. Okay, we'll be doing clouds of ice. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> no, seriously, I'm a bit afraid. Did I seriously say 
three parts, I meant four. It, it'd probably take four. Four parts. Jeez. What was I thinking of? So, clouds of ice. Oh, no, there's a dog in space. Oh, good old ice stages, though. They got some nice music, these ice stages. Ah! Oh! I think it's just these weird bottle cap shaped platforms from the ice stages. Because probably the ice stages that for the most part, all the ground is made out of ice. So, I'm not, so bottle cap thing I was just kind of... Ooh. And again, they put platforms like these, and they just kind of annoy me, because then you go jump over one, and get onto another, and then you go die. And it's it looks like you can get to that, just close. It's it's so close. That beginning bit, but, oh, goodness. Argonaut, you make the level design make me mad at times. But it's very fun, nonetheless. So yeah, I don't know why people can play about the controls too much. I definitely see how it could anger you, because especially if you're on like an analog control, it's it's really intended for digital controls. So for D-pads and stuff, and it really works well on a PC, that's why. Even even emulating, the controls work very fine. Oh, look at this. Okay, finally past that first room. More crystals for me. What do you expect in the chest? Golden gobbos. No. Whoa. Holy crap, we're developing a bridge. We made a bridge, but we only used it once. Ah, oh, stretchy, stretchy. Platform, platforms. Twitch it, twitch it, twitch it, twitch Ah, uh, yeah, I know. I know, it's been a while since I've made one of those references, but I may as well. Why can't they shoot fireballs instead of ice balls? Snowballs. Snowballs don't hurt. I like the guys who throw snowballs and the guys who shoot snowballs. Ah, there's a puzzle piece. Not really much to this stage, to be honest. I think I might... I might just squeeze in another one, just... just so... Very nice and calm, though. You know, it's just kind of three rooms. Didn't really go on for that much. Yeah, I expected it to go on for a bit longer. Oh, goodness. Hey! Are we going to Ice Bridge to Eternity? Ooh, that sounds good. I think I also got this stage, but I'm not too sure. I... I remember going to... I, I don't know, I think it was just the first secret stage. That was all the secret stages I, I'd found. So, 83%. Um, by the way, it's not possible to 100% the game on a save file. Mainly because the last... the last If you saw that first save file there, it's on 96%. That's because the last stage is a boss stage, and it does 4% of the save file. And, um... Oh, this is strange. Um, and you can't save off. Uh, you know, it's okay, you know, all the stages are still unlocked, so for the most part, it doesn't really change anything. What's the other one do then? Um, uh, but yeah, you know, you can't technically 100% the game. We, well, tech, you can't save 100%. Oh no! Goodness, are you doing this again? Alright. Oh, Fraps, come on! Alright. Thank you, Fraps. So yeah, if your Fraps is, is kind of lagging your game, just restart Fraps. Don't restart the program, restart Fraps. Sometimes, sometimes just turning off the recording and turning it back on works fine. You edit your videos, right? Seriously. Seriously, I learned this the hard way. If you're gonna if you're gonna make videos, do at least some editing. Oh my gosh, did you see that? 
Look how short that was. And it's like, look at this! Whoa, sweet extra life there. Other than that, though. Ah, oh, stretchy platforms! Look how thin they get. Oh no, it's the squeaky squeakers. All those guys. I hear the squeaky squeakers. Those freaking things which don't appear in it. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh no, I got hit for once. I'm gonna jump along the tops of these. Shazam! Now, how does this work in the grand scheme of things? I don't know. Music definitely, definitely knows what the mood is. Grab the, break the targets. It's just like you know, we don't care. Crystals for everybody, man and woman alike. I don't know. It keeps going. Look how tall we can make this room! I'm, I'm constantly saying... I said that three times now, and you know why? That makes sense. Alright. Here's Puzzle Beast. Okay, so in the next part... It, yeah, in the next part, I will probably beat the next set of special stages. Arabian Heights. But this is World 3. I'm, I'm a bit worried. Okay, so we're up to 84%. Which is good. I think we might we might have like three or so more parts left of the uh, LP or two. Depends. You'll be able to tell eventually. Okay, have fun, guys.